place your jump. No, um, um, every five seconds. Um, and then hey, I'm you got up as well, eh? I said no, you I'm not going to talk. Um... I'm not going to talk. <laughs> <laughs> it's very off-putting when that camera starts running. Oh, man, suddenly you become aware of everything. I think, I think um, John and Pat will agree uh, with me that um, normally July through to October is normally a very um, beautiful time of the country in Napier, whether you're arriving in, in Napier or leaving Napier to go through to Badal's or to the coast. Uh, where all the canola has just recently been planted and John helps them with the purple stuff. Um, the lupins. The lupins are coming up nice and purple now. And of course the wheat will, uh, the beautiful heads of the wheat will come through as well, which gives Napier a lovely... Why should anybody beef. come and live in the country? Why, why is it better to live out here than in Cape Town? Okay, that's true. I can carry on if you want me to. Yeah, I carry on for a bit. So, um, why should somebody come and live in Napier? But are you still um, getting value for money? Absolutely, yes. We are, <coughs> we're definitely getting value for money. <laughs> as, as opposed to, as opposed to um, <laughs> investing in property in in Cape Town, you must get 20% annual growth uh, on property. So, uh, it certainly makes sense to invest in Napier. Um, just just um, introducing John to the Cowan Properties team here. John uh, lives in Bedalsk, does um, some residential properties there as well, but his, his main function, which he really enjoys, is, is out, in, out on the farms. And Startup costs are lower, lower in the country, property is uh, cheaper in the country, and um, big business is looking at Bedalsk very seriously. We have two major shopping centres in Bedalsk now. Wonderful hiking trails and mountain biking trails in both the and Napier. Um, clean air, good roads, safe environment, and uh, it, it, it's, it's a good place to to live and a good place to raise a family. Okay, let's get into serious stuff now. Okay. Rugby. Ah, okay. What's going to happen this weekend? Well, obviously, um, the Stormers are going to thrash. Sharks, go! Sharks, go! <laughs> the Stormers are going to thrash. Sharks forever!